Hey Tyler, this is Melissa with Lady Boss Leads. I spoke to Summer earlier today and I wanted to take a quick minute and shoot over that video like we discussed. So I'm gonna go through your website and do an audit and show you what's holding you back from getting on the first page of Google and what you can do today to bring you the most value and start out ranking those competitors online. So the first thing I want to talk about is content. So when someone searches for, say, home remodeling Melbourne, Google has what's called crawlers. So they crawl the internet, searching and ranking those results. They're looking for keywords and what your site should be found for. Things like the services that you offer and what areas you serve. I'm looking at your site here. It looks great. I love the layout. It looks very professional. The pictures are nice has quite a bit of content as well, which is great. Content is key. Google loves to see a lot of content. They like to see at least a minimum of 1500 words on your homepage, using those keywords about 10 to 15 times at the minimum. And that's really gonna make a difference in Google ranking your site and pushing it to the top of their search engine. So if we go and do a Google search for say, home remodel Melbourne, Florida, you can see here, this is called the map pack. So these are all of the companies that have what's called a Google My Business page or a GMB. So ideally you wanna be in the top three of these because these companies are super easy to find. You don't have to scroll to the next page to find them. So they're gonna be getting the most phone calls for people that are searching for this kind of work. And I did see that you guys had a GMB, but I couldn't find you on the first or second page of that. So I just wanted to say some ways that you can help rank this is you can add a bunch of photos, um, at least 10 to 15, and you want to save those as those keywords because that counts as content in Google's eyes as well. So you don't want to save them as the random letters and numbers that a file automatically comes with. You want to change those and be some type of keywords like home remodeling Melbourne, something of that nature. Also, you want to have at least 25 five-star reviews. That's really going to push this to the top of that ranking as well. And again, with the keywords, you want to add some content with all of those keywords in this about us section. So that's going to help you rank that GMB. <clears throat> so we go back to the search engine. If you keep scrolling down, this is what's called the organic listings. So you want to be on the first page of this as well. Again, ideally in the top three, so you're easily found. So this guy, Todd Thomas Home Improvements, he's really going to be getting the most phone calls because he's in the top three of the GMB and he's the first listing in the organics. So let's go see what his website looks like. His website looks nice. He has a call to action page up here. Um, he has nice pictures, great layout. He doesn't really have, um, I mean, he has some content. But he doesn't really have a whole lot. It doesn't look like it's that 1500 minimum. So he would be easily outranked content wise. But obviously there's other things that go into SEO as well. So I use this program called AREF. So it takes a look and analyzes the website and shows you what's going on on the back end so we can see what we're up against. So this is what's called the UR and the DR rating. So these numbers are super important according to Google. This is how they rate your site and that's how you're gonna rank on the top of that page. So this UR number is how much Google trusts your site and the DR is how powerful your site is in Google's eyes. And these numbers are typically raised by backlinks. So you might be wondering what the heck a backlink is. <laughs> so a backlink is any website article or blog that's referring people back to your site. Google basically sees it as a popularity contest. The more people that are referencing your website URL, the more Google sees your site as being powerful and trustworthy. So they have 461 backlinks coming from 165 referring domains. Of those domains, 125 of those are coming from super powerful sites. All backlinks are not created equal. So you want to grab backlinks that are coming from powerful sites. That way Google sees you as being authoritative and they're going to push you above all of those other guys. And they have 565 keywords on their site and they have 243 people coming and looking at their site per month. Let's look and see what kind of keywords they have. So this volume column, this is how many people are coming to these specific keywords per month. 
So 70 people are searching for home remodeling Melbourne, Florida per month. Kitchen remodeling Melbourne, Florida 150 times. Cabinet refacing 70. Bathroom remodel 150. So those are some pretty high search volumes for these specific keywords. And that's a lot of the reason why they are ranking so well combined with the backlinks. So let's take a look at your site. <clears throat> So your site actually looks good too. You have 178 people coming and finding your site per month, 400 keywords, 206 backlinks coming from 105 domains and 78 of those, it looks like are powerful sites. So that's great. It really wouldn't take a lot at all to outrank your competition. So at the end of the day, I think if you can add some of those specific keywords we talked about to your homepage, bumping that up to at least 1500 words, and raising your UR and DR rating through backlinks and beating out your competition, you would be in great shape to get to the top of that Google page. I hope that you guys found this helpful and you can implement some of these strategies. Please leave me some feedback and I look forward to speaking to you soon. Have a great night.